zipper connection and today we're going to be shortening the Vislon zipper which is uh, Vislon is the brand name that YKK uses for the molded plastic teeth. Um, we're going to start the same that we have on the others. Um, you find the length that you need. This one we're going to shorten to 28 inches. So I put my chalk mark at 28. Bring the slider down to that. Take my scissors. Give myself about an inch above the chalk line. Cut that off. These teeth are a little bit different than the metal teeth. The metal teeth are U-shaped pieces that just go over the zipper tape. They're not really glued onto it, they're just pinched on there. So you're able to open up that U-shaped piece and they just fall off or cut it and they fall off. The molded plastic, however, are a little bit different. They're also a U-shaped piece, but they're fused to the zipper tape. So what we need to do is break that fusing. And the way I've done that is we start by snipping off the end of the tooth that goes beyond the zipper tape. They snip pretty easily, so you can go through there pretty well. You have to make sure that you don't go beyond the zipper tape and cut that. Um, as before, we go a little bit below our white chalk mark so that when we get the zipper finished, it will end up no longer than that. And now we have a little piece left on the back side and a little bit on the front side. But what I do with my wire cutter sideways is I go in and kind of pinch that and it separates the fusing and they just come right off. Sometimes you can even just like scrape that with your fingernail and they, they come off. So once you pull all those teeth off, then we need to have a way so that this slider won't go up and go beyond and come off. Um, with the metal zippers, we had the wire, the metal U-shaped piece that we would pinch back on there again. With this, the tooth is fused on there and we can't do that again. So what we need to do is, uh, okay. okay, we have the teeth off on one side and now we need to put a stop on there so that our zipper won't slide all the way off. Um, with the metal zippers, we can take that U-shaped piece off the top of the zipper and slide it down and, and reuse that. With these, they're fused together and when you take the tooth off, it's actually broken that tooth. So we need to get a U-shaped piece, like the metal ones. They come in a variety of colors. Um, we don't have all the colors that the zippers are in, but I have a beige here that uh, won't be too noticeable on this rust color zipper. So um, it is a U-shaped piece. I slide it on just above the last tooth, and then with my wire cutters, I pinch that snug against there, and I've got a top stop. Then you just complete the other side and you've uh, shortened a number 5 Vislon zipper. The same thing would be true of a number 10 Vislon, it's just the teeth will be a little bit harder to cut and you'll need the next size larger on the top stop. 